Well, hello and welcome to the Intuitive Messenger channel. They call me Mitchell and this is your Energy Forecast Intuitive Message for today, Friday the 13th. Yes, Friday the 13th of May 2016. And as always, thank you for taking time to retweet, post, subscribe, become a fan and share on your public websites, all that kind of stuff. Checking out my website, Intuitive Mitchell, um, joining the Orlando Terror Tribe on Meetup and uh, just being here. So, um, let me point it out first. Ba -bum, the Maybe Lenormand. It's um, 52 cards, so there's the 36 Lenormand and then some extra ones that Ryan Edward, who is just adorable, um, you know, to look at and in person to, to listen to speak. Um, he created this amazing, beautiful deck. It's simplistic and, and it speaks very loud and clear to me. Um, I haven't opened this box yet. I got to see the deck and, and play with it up there in Reader Studio. So check out Ryan Edward, the Maybe Lenormand. So your message for today is thus, be courageous today and ask what you've been wanting to. <laughs> There's a good chance you're going to get a yes. So, you know, don't be afraid to ask, you know, your boss for something, your partner for something, your friends, your family, you know, something you've been wanting that either most of the time we feel like guilty asking for something because we're like, oh, I don't want to ask, you know, and, and usually it's because we don't want to take gifts or accept help or something. Um, when you're probably one of the people who love to help and love to give and you're doing the very thing that you love to do you're not allowing other people to do for you so ask ask today I ask you today that you would just send high vibration to the person that most gets on your nerves today that's all I ask just send some high vibration to some hope and open up with them and just uh, raise the vibration of the world so cards numbers energy for today so today, the 13th day of May, all the numbers add up to number nine, which is about completions, endings. You know, it could be um, transformations. Uh, it's the number of perfection tolerance. It's a vision number. And Lenormand, to go along with that, is the ring, which is about um, commitments, um, marriage, um, you know, contracts, agreements, some other key words, um, partnership, I like that word, union, um, completion, because the circle is ch -ch complete. Tarot to go along with that is going to be Seven of Cups. So the Seven of Cups, first of all, seven, mystical, metaphysical, spiritual, but cups are emotional. So this card is about all these choices in front of you. Sometimes it paralyzes you. Sometimes you're like, oh my gosh, look at all my choices I get. So you can either be really excited or almost paralyzed by them. But this, I would say, is, you know, solidify, complete your choices, make your choices. Don't just sit around, ask for the help or whatever you need today, and then just do it. Um, it'll bring about some emotional um, completion or some endings to all the emotional distress. Um, but yeah, partner up with it. Make the decision. Go for it. Tomorrow, all the numbers add up to one. One is that masculine dynamic principle. Beginnings, independence, leadership, innovation. Lenormand to go along with it is the man which is 28, which is 10, which is 1. So we're right back to the agreement here. Oh, and, oh, and yesterday both of them were 7s because the 25 boils down to 7 and 7 of cups. So 7-7 seven, seven on a 9 deck, um, on a 13 deck. So the man, that could be me for you. It could be it's me in the reading because I am a man. If you're a man, it's you. If it's not, then there's a man in your life. And the tarot to go along with it is going to be, wow, it's like the same man. It's the same man in distress because um, Ciro Marchetti created this deck, so it's kind of some of the similar man. He's in distress. This man is upset because the Ten of Swords, swords air, logical, mental, mental, mental <laughs> thoughts. It's your words. It's your speech. The swords are being thrust in the back of this guy, you know, but I like to think he threw himself into the back. Um, you know, and there's just this pain that he's inflicting on himself um, or he thinks other people are doing it to him which is victim mode, which is not the truth. You create your reality. You create everything that comes to you. If you don't believe that, um, just hang on tight. It's going to be a rough life for you. And if you if you don't and you think there's something to it, then just start to slowly you know, accept and understand and, and just ask spirit, how can I see where I'm creating this? How can I 
not create this? How can I create what I truly want, not what I think I want? Makes sense? I hope so. So with this one energy, you know, and that's another one. It's a ten of swords. Tens boils down to one. So tomorrow, one, one, one. All these ones with this energy. So I would be like... <laughs> I'd be like, um, so <laughs> get out of this pain. You know, it's a big, it's a beginning energy day. So start something new. Stop the pain. Ask for the help tomorrow. Um, and I'm also hearing you have to just ride it out. It's gonna be like a one day thing. Ride out the pain, the storm, get through it. You know, maybe you're having to deal with a little minor minor surgery or you know a toothache or a pull or something like that, and you just have to ride it out and heal. So. There is your message for today and tomorrow. I thank you so very much. Hey, a week from tomorrow, the Orlando Tarot Tribe has its first meetup. We're right at 49 people. If you're in the Orlando area and you want to join, do it. Love to have 50. Love to have 100. We'll be there soon. But we're just going to get together and talk about where we want to go, um, bring some cards and decks, and have some fun. I'm giving away a couple books. Um, Tara for this new age is what I think it is. Oh, Tara for magic. No, I can't remember what it is. But some books by Rachel Pollock. Um, and then, oh, Sunday, where I'm going to Tampa for the Tampa Bay area tarot meetup which um, we're talking about the arc the, i think it's the major arcana the four elements june 5th um christiana from the tampa bay and i from the orlando tarot tribe now are having a, a workshop here at my house check that out all on meetup you can find it on my events page and uh i think that's about it for now namaste talk to you soon bye bye